We haven't heard what was he doing that made George think that. And, you know, that's what made George suspicious. And the prosecutor is going to say, well, that's not enough. Everything you saw was innocent details. So my question and for you is, you, uh, forgive me for interrupting you, but I'm just curious, is this okay. something that's going to be sort of the centerpiece of the case as we move forward? And, and a, a good attorney would have to, a uh, prosecutor would have to try to prove that? Or are, are you saying oh, that absolutely. the fact that we don't see it in the affidavit, which is, I, I think everybody kind of agrees, it's very bare boned, um, is an indication of a big problem for the prosecution? The prosecutor, Soledad, is going to absolutely have to show that. How else are they going to prove the element depraved mind? They're, they're going to have to show that George's belief was completely unreasonable, and that shows in and of itself a depraved mind. And the that's going to be a tough thing, a very tough thing. Are you surprised it's not in this affidavit, or is this affidavit? To me, the affidavit seems so bare bones that it, it gave me the sense, and you guys can jump in and tell me if I'm wrong, that she's intentionally not trying to put very much in. I mean, that's there's the nothing question. in the yeah. affidavit that's, that, that's what that we're trying to wrap our... we haven't had this conversation. Let me play for yeah. you what, what Alan Dershowitz, the Absolutely. noted defense attorney, said, and, and I think a lot of other attorneys have jumped in to agree with him. Let's